Here we are, another ho home night. And yep, here it comes. Another rocket. All right, let's see if I can get. How about that one, huh? That is so cool. Right? Nice American flag, a little rocket going up. Not too shabby. So with the winds of Etta being sucked across the state and the high pressure just creating a funnel, I finally got a great nighttime rocket shot with the flag. I know this is bragging, but it really is just the normal day-to-day -day where I live. They send up so many rockets, we kind of look outside and go, what do you think? Eh, I don't know. But fortunately, I went outside, Got the rocket with the American flag in the background. Not a bad shot. Now we will zoom in. It's not the clearest trail from a rocket that I've had, but it is a nice one. You can see the color change. I would assume that has to do with the temperature of the air as they're heading up into space. Not real sure. Just a very uneducated guess. And since I can't do anything in two minutes, I'm gonna add some of the air show and some more great American power to my video. I hope you enjoy these clips of the air show. The Thunderbirds and the B-2 Bomber. These are a few of my favorite clips from the Melbourne Air Show in 2018, I would think. Uh, we were sitting in the river right at the end of the runway. Mikhail had put the boat perfectly right at the end of the runway and man, we just got shot after shot as those planes lined up right on the top. It really was a fantastic day getting killed shots. Next we have the V-2 Bomber, a piece of military equipment that is expensive, fun to operate, and made to just wreck everything in its path. Be it an X-Tanker, I love stuff like this. Those M1 tanks were just as cool as a B-2 Bomber. So thin, what a small target. That thing is so cool. It made my day to be able to see that thing fly right over my head that close. Thanks for watching. I will see you next time.